Hi everyone, welcome to my channel and in today's video I am going to answer the question whether an oil painting dries in direct sunlight or not and at the end of the video I will tell you how you can make your oil paintings dry quickly and at a cheaper price. So without any further ado let us get into the video. And start with answering the question whether an oil paint dries quickly in direct sunlight or not. Well, oil painting contains oils in them as the medium and when you see other mediums like watercolor and acrylic paint, it is having water. So when water is exposed to direct heat, that is direct sunlight, it will evaporate and eventually the pigments are left behind with the binders and they are dry. But in case of an oil paint, we are using oil as I have mentioned. So oil dry with a process known as oxidization, which does not happen with direct sunlight. It happens with air. If you are seeing your painting drying in a direct sunlight, it means that the reason is not the direct sunlight, but actually the breeze or the wind blowing across your painting. So when oxidization is happening, which is happening in the presence of air, your painting will dry sooner. When you're keeping your painting in direct sunlight, we as a beginner do not understand the consequence of keeping the painting in direct sunlight because the sunlight is having UV rays and that is the most effective way to ruin your paintings and the pigments and also your pigments will be lighten up over time if exposed to direct sunlight for longer durations of time so i would recommend you guys not to open your window for direct sunlight and keeping the painting in direct sunlight though it might help you in drying the process but the later effects of exposure to direct sunlight will harm your painting eventually also when you're keeping your painting outside in sunlight there are other factors there are other things that will come and stick onto your paintings like flies and leaves and dust particles so it's better to dry your painting in a room i would recommend you guys to use a table fan or something uh, which you can keep in front of your painting so that the breeze is always crossing your painting and hence the painting will dry very quickly with oxidization now some people ask me whether they can use hair dryer or a heater to dry the painting again I have told that the heat is not the major factor in drying of the painting. The hot air that is present in the hair dryer will eventually dry the initial that is the topmost layer of the oil painting but do not confuse that the entire painting is dry because the inner layers wouldn't have dried and that will result in uneven drying of the painting and hence might result in cracking also. So beware of using a hair dryer which is mixed with heat. Of course heat will help in speed up the oxidization process but it will also lead to drying of the layers unevenly and hence causing breakage at some point. Now when we talk about other paintings like acrylic and watercolors uh, they must also not be kept in direct sunlight. Humidity in the atmosphere also plays a very important role. Now if you're living in a climate which is very humid the oil painting will take a lot of time to dry and that is because of a lot of water particle and lot of moisture present in the atmosphere. The dry air will dry your painting so the dry air is the most important thing. If you are in a climate where you're, you are having a lot of humidity you can use a dehumidifier at home. You can dehumidify your room where you are keeping your oil paintings along with a fan and then that will dry your painting. Also in case of direct sunlight what happens happens is that because of the heat there is a chemical reaction which is taking place with the oils and hence will change the composition of the paint also so direct sunlight is a big no-no a normal painting of acrylic paint will take an hour to dry whereas an oil painting will take six to eight hours to dry so humidifier could be another thing now if you're living in a very dry climate you would have seen that during summer times your painting will dry very fast it's because of less humidity in the atmosphere i have made a video on humidity on this video this was a very scientific study i had done on drying of the oil paints there were some experiments 
experiments run later on which I studied into which when the painting was exposed to direct sunlight the pigments were becoming colorless and then the paintings which were not exposed to direct sunlight like they were having a film on top of them like a frame or something then that painting had much more uh, consistency in their pigments later on the paintings which were kept inside a room were showing very little or minimal effect of sunlight or pigmentation colorlessness okay so that is why uv is the most dangerous thing that can happen to your painting so i will tell you what not to do well some people have spoken about using hair sprays uh, since hair dryers i have already spoken about hair dryers but when you put a hair spray on the painting obviously it will make a film so when you're using the hair spray it does not make the painting dry faster what it actually does it it makes a film on top of the oils on your canvas which is dry the film is dry and under that the oil paints are not dry again that will result in cracking the hairspray which you have used is not the same medium as the oils used in the oil paintings and hence it will result in cracking or deterioration of the painting so do not use hairspray in order to speed up the drying process now also the drying time of an oil paint depends on the surface onto which the oil paint is applied like if it is applied on wood or on boards it will dry quickly because the wood will eventually absorb some of the oils also but then when it comes to the canvases it will take a little bit longer time and uh, when you have painted on metals it will take even more long time because on metals there is no absorption happening on the surface right or inside the surface now you will be thinking about whether people paint on metals yes people do paint on copper plates and uh, metallic plates i have seen artists doing that also if you want to know about that mention that in the comment section below and i will make another video on that now we have come to the bonus section wherein i will tell you what you can do to make your oil paintings dry very faster and at a cheaper price the number one solvent that you can use is turpentine it will dry it will make your oil painting dry very quickly if you're using a turpentine well as an artist i have experimented a lot with oil paints and i have seen what are the mediums that affect me and the oil paintings also affect means when i'm using turpentine which i have totally discarded from my art supply section because this was giving me headaches but yes turpentine you can use a little bit of turpentine to make your oil paintings dry now make sure not to use a lot of turpentine because it will result in deterioration of the binder and hence the pigments will not get binded to the canvas and later on might result in cracking also so be sure that you're using very little solvent in order to make your paintings dry faster though you can use a little bit of it but then the fumes will go into your lungs and you have to be aware of that if you're okay with using turpentine in your studio you can go ahead and use turpentine another thing that you have to keep in mind is the ratios of the solvent and the binder so the solvent should be in two is to one ratio like two parts of the solvent with one part of linseed oil which will make your painting stick to the canvas so the quantity of the binder is also very very important now the next thing that you can use is you can buy mediums from camel which will make your paint more flowy so uh, you can use mediums which will fasten the drying process i have recently found out is that camel is also making mediums for oil paints and i'm gonna try that and i will put a review uh, later on in the future so yeah you can use mediums also i haven't used mediums myself because turpentine had worked very well for me and i find oil paintings to be drying slowly is the best thing now this takes us to the next Thing that you can do in order to make your uh, paintings dry quickly and that is to use oils 
Yes, linseed oil is the fastest drying oil. A little bit of linseed oil will make your paintings dry a little bit faster. Now make sure again that you're not in a very humid climate. If you are in a humidity atmosphere, then you need to use a dehumidifier and fan will work a lot better. And then uh, you can also use poppy seed oil and clove oil. Well, I have made a video on clove oil, which is used in cleaning of the brushes. Then that will make your painting dry even more slower so now in case if you want to make your paintings dry slowly even increase the drying time of an oil paint which many artists like because they want to work on focal point and stuff i have spoken about focal point also in this video here and i have also spoken about the clove oil the oil which i have mentioned recently in this video so you can go and watch about a clove oil and stuff you can do with the clove oil another thing that you can do is is to paint in thin layers now when you're painting you're painting in thinner layers obviously it is very thin film of oil paint which will dry eventually very quickly so once your first layer is dry then you can work on the other one and then you can work on the other one on top of it making sure that the painting is done in thin layers also make your painting you know very easy to varnish again varnishing the painting will be easier if you're working in thinner layers some of the artists like to use a lot of paint and that is all okay because they are okay with the drying of the oils now if you have painted your painting and you you're painting fairly okay like not in very thin layers and also not in very thick layers you see that your painting is dry in a month what you can do is you can put a thin layer of varnish on top of it in order to make it dry even faster what i have seen with varnishes is that it will make the painting dry faster like if your painting is already dry varnishes will also dry very quickly but i would recommend you guys to wait at least two or three months if you do not have any show coming up again with varnishes the one more thing is that you can use very good varnish well i have another story all about varnishes so i'll be talking about that later yeah when you're putting your painting outside to dry make sure that you're covering it up with some form of uh, shield on top of it because what will happen that the flies in the air and the dust will get stuck to it so put a film on top of uh, your painting if you're keeping your painting to dry in open air in fact inside a room also when you will varnish a painting you will see some dust particles sticking to the painting so they are all present they are everywhere okay so you have to be very very sure that your room is all clean while varnishing or while putting your painting for drying now guys if you have any questions you can mention those things in the comment section below and if you want to learn more about art you can watch my playlist here here is the playlist do not forget to subscribe to my channel and click the like button also click on the bell button as well so that you will get notified when i put another video because i'm gonna put a lot of these videos thank you so much for watching my videos and i will see you in the playlist okay I will see you there. Thank you so much for tuning in.